Hello, welcome back to my channel. It is Amanda. I'm here with my Color Pan 2.0 update. It's not that late. I was gonna say it's really late again, but I don't think it is actually that late. I feel like my update, my last update went up much later than I had filmed it. So I feel like there's been a lot of time in between, but sometimes that's how it goes, you know? This is a project in kind of collaboration with the Fantastic Ladies Facebook group. I feel, maybe I am wrong, but I feel that those projects are very easy to kind of make your own, go at your own schedule. I know there is a schedule, but I don't know if it really matters if you follow it. I hope not because I haven't been following it very well. That being said, I do enjoy this project. What we're doing is taking five items from the ColourPop brand or any of their sister brands, 4th Ray Beauty or Soul Body, and attaching goals to them, whether it's to finish them, usage goals, whatever that might be. I have five items here, and then we have some updates, so let's get to it. The first thing that I finished, finally, was the 4th Ray Beauty Matcha Face Milk. I really don't feel like this, I don't really have an opinion about this. It didn't break my face out, but it didn't do anything amazing. Um, I don't really even know who I would say that this is like for because I don't feel like it did much of anything negative or positive. You know, I'm certainly glad it wasn't a negative experience, but I didn't really notice anything after using this. I prefer my regular moisturizers to a face milk or something like that. So if you prefer a face milk, maybe you would enjoy this. But for me, I'm going to stick with a regular moisturizer. But I'm glad to have finished it. And there was really no scent to it. I was hoping it was like matcha. It didn't really smell like anything. So that is done. We are removing that. The next item is the Soul Body Body Spritzer in Sea Bloom. And this is also done. I've been using these as perfumes because that's basically what they are. <laughs> my goal is to finish a lot of my smaller perfumes this year. So I kind of set this aside to begin with and was gonna focus on it. And then I saw this project come up and I thought that would be perfect to really, really push me in the right direction. So I finished this. I really like the smell of this. It, it is a very watery scent. I don't know the notes. Lilies or, I don't know. I'm terrible at that. I don't know if you can even still purchase this. So if you can, I will put the notes on the screen, but otherwise, I don't know. I'll, I'll try to find them. This is a very light, watery, fresh scent. I really enjoy it. I don't think the body spritzers last a terribly long time on my skin or in my instance, in my hair, because that's where I typically spray my perfume, but they smell really nice when I'm applying them. The longevity just isn't really there. I think that's pretty typical for any sort of body mist though. I don't ever find that those last as long as a full-on perfume. But I finished this, happy to remove it and move on. So the next thing is the Lippy Stick in Juice Bar. And my goal for this is to use it 25 times. And I had to look because I thought, I don't, I don't remember at all how many times I've used this. I've used it three times. I am just so bad at wearing lip products, which is why I try to put lip products in projects so I can actually get use out of them. There's no update visible on this. I've used it three times. I like this color. I like this product. It's very easy to wear. I am just really bad at wearing lip products. So I'm not even going to show you the page with the update because there's, there's no visible update on it. I've used it three times. Next we have two eyeliners. These are the ColourPop cream gel liners. And the first is Fiery Fierce. This one I've been wearing quite a lot. Uh, there's not a ton left of this eyeliner. And I really like this color. I, I wear this color a lot, actually. Um, I'm wearing it today. I don't know if you can actually see that, but I feel good about the progress in making this. I will insert a picture of the like the update because I can't hold. You know, it's like holding. Pleased with how that is going. That will be done at some point. I just don't know when. The other eyeliner is called Groundbreaker, and this is uh, these are both from the Avatar collection. I haven't used this one quite as much. I'm trying to make sure I don't break it. Um, but I definitely have used it. I don't think this is going to be a very good indicator, so I'm going to show you the paper. I just don't wear brown eyeliner that much, which is weird because for a long time I wore brown eyeliner, like bronze eyeliner 
all the time. I'm just kind of out of that phase, but I'm not finished with either of these. I'm definitely much closer on Fiery Fierce, but we're working on it. The next item in here is the ColourPop Super Shock in Paisley, and my goal is to finish this. I didn't look up how many times I've used this yet. I use this a lot as an inner corner highlight, so that is a very slow way to do it, but lately I have been trying to use my finger and tap more all over my eye. It's starting to get pretty crumbly, um, but I feel like this is some good progress that's being made. This is sort of a topper shade, so it will go with a lot of different things, but it's also a very warm topper shade. I'm gonna wear it with more warm looks, you know? So if I haven't finished it, it'll be a while, but we're getting there. I don't know why I had six items when I started this. Is it supposed to be six items? I thought it was five items. I'm down to five items. I don't know. I'm going to be adding in the other Soul Body Body Spritzer, and this is in Sunkissed Coconut. I, <laughs> after I finished Sea Bloom, I said, well, I'm going to start Sunkissed Coconut, and I'll just film that update in a day or two. It won't, it won't matter. So I marked it, and I don't know what happened because I'm well below the, the, the line from where I started. So I, I'm going to update the mark, but I started at that black line, and I've already used a bunch of it even though this is the first you're seeing this product. This is how I film, okay? It's chaos. My goal is also to finish this. I feel pretty confident about that. When I use body spritzers. I usually use them several times a day and I use multiple spritzes. It will be finished at some point, you know? And this smells delicious. This is a perfect summer scent. For as much as I don't love coconut, this coconut smell I am really into. So that is my update. I am running out of ColourPop products that will be easy to finish because I have a lot of super shocks, I have a lot of eyeshadow palettes, and then you know full-size blushes and other full-size lip products so I'm not sure what I will be able to add in and I, I guess I probably won't have the goal of finishing them they'll just be usage goals which is fine too. I still need usage goals very clearly. Hello juice bar. If you guys enjoy any sort of projects, I would love to hear your progress. Thank you guys so much for watching. I will talk to you in my next video.